intercept her on station. Getting thick out here. Threat vector more. Push through. Stay tight and maintain flight data link. Homeworld 3 is a real-time strategy game set in three-dimensional space. The Higarans and Incarnate are at war over the fate of the galaxy. You'll need to protect your mothership, harvest resources, and secure key objectives. Go for operations. Acquiring resources is the vital first step in any mission. They are limited and need to be managed carefully. You are cleared for collection. You'll use resources to construct the ships you need to achieve victory. Docking cleared. Once you get the essentials down, you'll be commanding your own fleet in no time. Mothership, standing by. Build some recon units to explore your surroundings. Scout ready. Launching. On station. Clear copy. Moving on position. Monitor by zone. Now use those recon ships to see if you can locate them. We've got incoming. Enemy strike craft closing fast. Your recon unit is under attack. Get them out of there. Break, break, break. Disengage. Pull back. Max power. Now that we know they have strike craft, you'll need to make some of your own. Interceptor is away. Now, order them to attack. Got it in dynamic range. Firing. Target down. Nice work. Familiarize yourself with enemy ships so you'll know how to counter them. Don't forget to keep tabs on your mothership. If your mothership is destroyed, it's game over. Exploring, building, collecting resources. It's your mobile base of operations. Bomber construction complete. Just remember, while you're making plans, so is your enemy. It may look like the enemy has the advantage, but you can use the environment to turn the tide. Hide your bombers in that debris. We're off sensors. Stay tight. Converge. Watch my lead. Strong lock. Light them up. Direct hit. That did it. Target destroyed. Very nice. If a battle looks hopeless, try changing tactics to turn the tide in your favor. We copy. Grouping your ships into formation offers a tactical benefit. Try putting your ships into the balanced delta formation. Understood. Factory on target. How active a role you want to take in commanding your fleet is up to you. Tracking locked in. Each ship can be given individual commands beyond moving or fighting. Order your interceptors to guard your bombers. Moving to guard. That will stop them from chasing off after a lone ship and leaving your bombers unprotected. Good read. Maintain alert. Some commands allow you to direct how your ships function in combat. Examine your bombers' stances and set them to passive. Hostile tracking only. This will ensure they only engage on your orders. Enemy strike craft sighted. Ion Frigate is ready. Many ship types have unique abilities. Assault Frigate ready for action. These units are great for mixing it up against enemy strike craft. That's in it. Nice work. Ready for operation. Combat ships aren't the only units with special abilities. Copy. We're on it. Resource collectors can capture damaged enemy ships Bay is clear. and convert them to your side. Group one, reinforced. It can be hard to keep track of so many things at once. If you ever feel overwhelmed, take a tactical pause. Look around, consider your options, and issue your orders. Watcher 6. Production is now ready. Change access. Target locked. Let's go! Good shot. Enemy ship destroyed. Your fleet follows you from mission to mission, so remember to repair damaged ships to limit your losses. Ship pilots are the lifeblood of your fleet. Do what you can to protect them. Possible contacts. Verify echoes. There's more to Homeworld than combat. Let's try logistics. Homeworld 3 has a lot of tools to make it easier to control large fleets. Drag your mouse to select interceptors and bandbox them into a control group. Group 1 assigned. You can then command each group as though it were a single unit. You can do this with multiple groups, making it easy to switch between strike craft, bombers, or whatever combinations you want. You can also select an individual ship from within a control group. Go for bomber. You can hold the control key and bandbox an enemy group to attack all targets inside. Engaging destroyer. Watch the crossfire. Ship target. Ship target. Direct hit. Scratch one. There are all kinds of things to explore in the anomaly. It's important for us to know what's out there. Potential resources, ambush points, unknown enemies. Space conceals them all. Let's experiment with camera controls. There are two main camera settings to help you navigate the three-dimensional battlefield, modern and legacy. 
If you're a Homeworld veteran, you're already familiar with the legacy controls. Players who prefer FPS-type camera controls may want to try the modern setting. You also have camera modes for individual units. Focus mode lets you see the battlefield while being locked and tracked on any ship you choose. Copy that. Adjusting vector. I'm getting ghost feedback from the terrain. We have contact. Disengage! Break, 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 break! You can even use it on enemy ships. Enemy frigate on intercept. Need support. Hold steady, I'm coming around. Can't get loose. Locked up. Missiles incoming. The mothership is taking fire. We copy. Closing on pre-launch. Form up. Ready to copy. Punch it. Good shot. Very impressive. Maybe you're ready to try something new. Take the skills you've learned into different game modes. Threat detected. Let's move. Action successful. Stand by for gate commit on my mark. Your path is up to you. Commander, your fleet awaits. 